Ross Chastain name has been brought up so many times this season for multiple reasons. One of the reasons is, well, he's fast as hell this year. He's a legit championship threat. He's got two wins and he's sitting third in the points as we're recording this video. Ross Chastain could possibly win the 2022 NASCAR Cup Series championship. But the other reason why his name is being brought up so many times is because his aggression on the track. Now, Ross Chastain being aggressive isn't anything new. He's always been like this in the lower series. Ross drives like it's going to be his last race he ever competes in. He drives like he doesn't have any job security. That's because most of his career, he's had to fight and claw to get where he's at today. Ross doesn't bring sponsorship. He doesn't bring a lot of money. So he drives like his career is on the line. I think he doesn't necessarily need to do that anymore because I think Justin Marks, who's the owner of Trackhouse Racing, has seen enough. I think Ross doesn't need to drive over his head. Now, when it comes to Ross Chastain, he reminds me of a driver from back in the day, and that's Ernie Irvin, a young Ernie Irvin. For those who are not familiar with Ernie, he was a guy that drove over his head a lot, kind of like Ross Chastain does. He made a lot of enemies on track. It's the reason why he got the nickname Swerve and Irvin, because he was all over the place. But Ernie actually acknowledged his wrongs and actually apologized to his competition in the driver's meeting. Ernie didn't lose his edge afterwards either. He actually remained competitive. He was actually challenging Dale Earnhardt for the 94 title before he got seriously injured. All Ernie did was back it down a notch, and really, that's all Ross Chastain needs to do. Look, Ross is a good dude, you can clearly see that in his interviews. He's humble. I don't think he wants to make enemies. I think eventually he'll start to calm down and stop racing over aggressively. I'm not sure when that's going to be, but hopefully it's real soon. So that's my opinion on that. Do you guys think that he's like a young Ernie Irvin as well or am I alone on that? Let me know. I'm gonna go ahead and roll up out of here. Y'all end up having a good one. Peace.